Lawn aeration, what is it and do you even need it? Let's start talking about what lawn aeration really is. You know, have you ever walked past somebody's house and you're like, it looks like there's a bunch of little goose poops all over the place, or duck poop all over the place. Well, that lawn was probably aerated. So why do you do it? Aeration is super important for the lawn for many different reasons. But if you have weeds, let's say, that means that there was a void in the lawn, the lawn was thinning, and so it gave way to a weed. And so if you have a really, really thick lawn, there's no way for weeds to actually grow there because it'll choke the weeds out. But if you have these little chinks in the armor, as I would call them, where your lawn is thinning, or you have a bare spot or whatnot, that's where lawn aeration and seeding comes to play. That's where the weeds actually grow. The reason we aerate your lawn is for many different options. You have weeds, let's say you spend time out back, you play with your kids, you play frisbee with your dogs, there's a lot of compaction on the lawn. Your lawn's struggling for some reason and it's starting to thin out. That's where aeration comes in. So aeration, what it's going to do is we're gonna use a hydraulic aerator wherever we can and we're gonna poke holes in the lawn. And our goal is a three inch deep tine plug. And so what that does is it pulls out a plug of soil and that's alleviating compaction. It's allowing the fertilizers to get into the root zone and water and oxygen and all those nutrients to get into the root zone of the actual turf. And that helps build it up. Just imagine you go to the hospital and you need an IV shot into your arm. It's putting that directly into your bloodstream. And so when we aerate and we break up these holes in the lawn and we can get the water and the nutrients and the oxygen and all that stuff right down to the root zone, it's almost like giving yourself an IV or having the doctors give you an IV. When we do this, we're going to go over the lawn twice. And what we're trying to do is pull out these, these plugs so then we can actually fill those holes with grass seed. And why do we want to do that? Well, when you put grass seed in those areas, you start to make the lawn thicker. And when you make the lawn thicker, what it does is it starts choking out all the weeds. So naturally, you start having less weed problems. This is not an overnight success. This is something that needs to happen on a consistent basis every single year for the first three or four years potentially. And then once you have a really thick lawn, and as long as you follow all the watering instructions that we give you after the seeding, then you're gonna start getting a really thick lawn. Grass has a life cycle just like you and I do. Over time, your lawn is going to start thinning out. It's gonna start dying out. And you need to replenish that with new seed, new germination. Achieve that in the fall time. That's the only time that we aerate is in the fall. We are going to rebuild seed into your lawn. And after you get a thick lawn, then maybe you can go every two to three years for aeration and seeding. One thing that really separates Blue Duck Lawn Care from anybody else in our area is that historically we've always sent out two technicians on every aeration job. And now why would we do that? It costs us extra money and labor to send out multiple people on an aeration job, but we know that you're gonna get a much, much better quality job for us. So maybe that's why our price tag is a little bit higher. What does that second person do? Great question. The second person uses what's called a garden weasel and they break up all the little small areas in the lawn. If you have bare spots and all you do is aerate and seed, you're not gonna get enough seed in those areas to really make a big difference. So the second person goes around the lawn with this garden weasel and manually tills those areas so then we can get a much better seed bed. So when we overseed, then it is going to get a much better seed to soil contact and we can actually start filling those areas in much better. That's the big difference between hiring a small local company like us. We get to make those decisions and we know that our goal is always to enhance our community. Sometimes when you work with some of the really big, large corporate national companies, they care about one thing, and that's profit at the end of the day, which we all have to worry about. They are going to cut corners when they can, and they are not going to do those little things, those little details that are going to make your lawn the best lawn on the block and the best lawn that you possibly can. And those little details are having technicians that are going to get that garden weasel out and actually do extra work on your property to make it the very best that it can possibly be. So if you're looking for a great team to take care of your aeration and seeding this fall, Give us a call, Blue Duck Lawn Care. We would be happy to help.